2. Read. Before we proceed with today's reading video, it is very important that you watch 2C1 vocabulary and then watch this reading video. A. Listen and read. Where would you hear these dialogues? We have three dialogues, conversations. Where would you hear them? In which place? At home? At the doctor's? At the supermarket? Where do you think these dialogues happened? Listen. 1. What about going shopping? I don't know. I'd like to go for a coffee today. I don't have money to go shopping. Come on. Oh, look. These shoes are amazing. I'd like to try them on. But they are pink. You can't stand pink shoes, right? I know, but I can check the colours they have. Let's go inside. Ah. Oh. Two. <sighs> I'm out of breath. Let's stop running for a while. In a bit. You know how much I love jogging. Yes, I do. So what do you think of my idea? It's fantastic. We can come here every morning and jog before school. Yeah, and this place is amazing, full of trees and people. Do you want to come again tomorrow then? Sure, I'd love to. 3. Listen to this. We have a new student at school. Really? What is this person like? Her name is Lena. She's really nice. She's funny and very outgoing. Is she a good student? She is, actually. And she's also very active. She likes painting and hanging out with her friends. I'd like to meet her sometime. Good idea. I can invite her to my house next weekend and we can spend some time together. Great! It's our turn. What about going shopping? I have an idea. I want your opinion on this idea. Use what about? I don't know. I'd like to go for a coffee today. This is what I want. I'd like to do this. I don't have money to go shopping. Come on! Oh, look! These shoes are amazing! They are great! Incredible! I'd like to try them on. When you try shoes on, that means you want to see them on your feet. You want to see how they look on your feet. You want to see if they fit you, if they look nice. But they are pink. You can't stand pink shoes. You can't stand. You hate pink shoes, right? I know. But I can't check the colors they have. I want to go ask if they have more colors. I want to make sure that uh, pink is the only color they have. Maybe they have red, blue, or other colors. Let's go inside. Let's go into the store. Ugh. Fatin is very tired of shopping with Selma. So where do you think this dialogue happened? Where? At the mall. Why? They want to go inside the store to check if they have more colors. It happened at a shopping mall. 2. I'm out of breath. When I do this... <sighs> What am I doing? I'm breathing, breathing, breathe. Breathe is the verb. Breath is the noun. Breath is the air coming out of your lungs, of your body. I'm out of breath. That means I find it very difficult to breathe. I can't... It's very difficult. I can't breathe. I'm out of breath. You can say, I can't breathe. <laughs> I can't breathe or I'm out of breath. Let's stop running for a while. Let's take a break. 
In a bit, not now, after a while. Let's keep going. You know how much I love jogging. Jogging is uh, slow running or fast walking. Yes, I do know that you love jogging. So, what do you think of my idea? Tom made the idea of jogging every morning. And he is asking his friend Harry about his opinion. Do you think it's a good idea? What do you think of my idea? It's fantastic. You are amazing. The idea is great. We can come here every morning and jog before school. Yeah, and this place is amazing. Fantastic. Full of trees and people. Do you want to come again tomorrow then? Shall we meet tomorrow? Sure, of course, I'd love to. Where do you think these two are jogging? They are jogging at the park. How do we know this? Because this place is full of trees, full of people. It's got to be the park. 3. Listen to this. We have a new student at school. Really? What is this person like? Describe this person. Tell me more about this student. Her name is Lena. She is really nice. She is cool. She is funny and very outgoing. She likes meeting people and talking to people. Is she a good student? Does she work hard? She is actually, yes, in fact, yes. She is a good student. And she is also very active. She is not lazy. She is full of energy. She likes painting. Painting is when you use colors, red, blue, green, to make illustrations of trees, people, houses, and hanging out with her friends. She likes to talk and stay with her friends. I'd like to meet her sometime. Good idea. I can make you two meet. I can invite her to my house. I can ask her to come and visit me in my house next weekend. And we can spend some time together. We can pass our time together, stay together. That would be great. Where do you think this dialogue happened? It sounds like this dialogue happened at home. Maybe these two girls are related. Maybe they are sisters or family. And they are talking about a girl at school. So I think this dialogue happened at home. B. Read again and complete the sentences with names. Use names. Names like Tonya, Jane, Harry and Tom, Selma and Fatten. These are the names we're going to use to fill these blanks. 1. Who doesn't want to go shopping? This is from Dialogue 1. This girl is saying, ugh, like, uh, I'm tired of shopping, let's go home. Fatten is the one who enjoys going jogging. This is from Dialogue 2. Let's stop running. No, in a bit, not now. Harry loves the idea of jogging. 3. Is a good student and a funny person. Who is a good student? This is from here, Dialogue 3. Okay, her name is Lena. Lena is the new student. She is funny and outgoing. 4. Who wants to buy a pair of shoes? Dialogue 1. Not fatten, it's Selma. She wants to go inside and check the colors. Selma. Who likes her new classmate? Dialogue 3. It's Tonia. Tonia is the one who was talking to Jane about the new student Lena at school. Tonia. 6. 
Who is very tired? Tired is when you feel that you can't continue. You need a break. You need some rest. Dialogue 2. I'm out of breath. He can't breathe because he is very tired, even though he doesn't want to stop. Harry is very tired. 7. Who would like to have coffee? It's here. I'd like to go for a coffee today. Fatten is the one. 8. Who enjoys spending time with her friends? It's the new girl at school. She is outgoing. Lena. Look. She is really nice. She is funny and very outgoing. What's the meaning of outgoing? She likes spending time with friends. Lena, the new student. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, share it with friends. I will leave you now with the workbook exercises. I'll see you again next time, inshallah. Goodbye.